So we lit that challenge. There's nothing there, nothing there. And nothing over here. There's something up here though. That's a challenge. General, we observe something strange in the night. We are camped above the city of Gatesh as the city prepares for invasion. They still believe the attack will come from on high. They will not expect your charge from the paths on the far side of the valley. But I must tell you, on the tower at the heart of the city, something unnatural awaits us. We watched hundreds of armored soldiers ascend its heights, and then a light cracked the sky. There was a sound that froze my blood, a roaring like an army of hungry ghosts. Then the men descended again. I do not know what they keep atop that tower. We thought it a treasure, but it appears to be something else entirely. This is hmm, particularly odd. Has elements of Scythian design, but it looks like a. No, n not possible. Hmm, okay. Oh, okay. This was another challenge, and uh, that's the last one. Okay, great. That's done, and the document should be um, there. We have sealed the doors and barred them from entry. The riders are coming, and I must keep these people safe. Mothers with children, old men like me. Those that cannot fight. I have food and water in sufficient quantities to keep us alive for the length of the attack. Should our Athanatoi fail and the attack becomes a siege, we will die here. For that, I have enough Belladonna to provide the little ones with safe passage. Pray it never comes to that. Yeah, now it's only the document over there, but I have no clue how to reach that one yet. So Yeah, uh, he that guy's dead. Lara. They're going to break through the ice any minute. 
Do you think you can stop them? The best we can do is buy you some time. I'll see you on the other side. Is it? The Chamber of Souls. The Divine Source has to be there. Looks like the way into the city center is through that gate. Yeah, we're almost at the end. Wait, we... Oh, no, we're in a new area. Probably a big one as well. I have failed. There will be no pardon for my sins. I have drenched my hands in blood in pursuit of the Prophet, and now there is nothing left. As the attack became a siege, the Prophet's people did the unthinkable. They turned their weapons against the glaciers and buried their own city. Mongol and the Prophet's people alike were crushed in the ice. The Khan and his warrior horde are dead. The people of Katesh are broken and scattered. I alone survive in the frozen heart of the city, and my only companions are the deathless army of the Prophet, their eyes aflame with unholy light. Even now, they hunt the ruins for survivors. Okay. And there's a campfire, good. I don't know what I expected an immortal being to be like, but Jacob seems so human. The things he must have seen over the years, all that experience and knowledge, it's difficult to fathom. And yet, he lied to his own people for generations, all for the sake of this secret. What wonders will be unlocked with the Divine Source? Will humans finally understand the true nature of the soul? Or will it unlock some extraordinary new scientific discovery? One thing is certain. It's too important to allow Trinity to control. Let's see. We got all of these. Five more here and just a few more here, but that's only dodge kills, I think. I rarely craft anything like that anyway, so but these might do. I need to go back and see if we can find that last document. Let's see if we can find it. Then it has to be up here. I must just have passed it. Ah, oh, there it is. 
I leave these notes for whoever should follow in my footsteps. My wounds are worse than I believed. They will not heal. Tonight I will make one last attempt to escape this frozen tomb, but I doubt I have the strength. A divine source is here, at the peak of the tallest tower, but it is beyond my reach. With the source at his disposal, the Prophet's deathless ones are unstoppable, an army of wraiths and devils that can never die, a mockery of all God's creation. They are no longer human, and they will break any army that stands in their way. With every death and rebirth, they learn. They adapt. Should Trinity someday find a way to seize it for ourselves, I fear that we will do no better. Perhaps it would be best if it were to remain lost forever. Okay, well, he did die. Poor guy. And now this area is 100% as well. Very close to all uh, documents. There are seven more in that area. Which means that there has to be one more area after this. I think. Down we go. Okay, we should do that, I think. So what are we working with? We have uh, four challenges. One crypt. One tomb. I think that's the last tomb. A lot of relics. Some documents, murals, survivor caches, coin caches. Okay. Pretty much the entire package. The deathless are patrolling the street. Got to stay out of sight. Don't think we can stay out of sight. I would like to know what that is. That's a bell. So yeah, that's one challenge. Need to find four more. And that uh, Open something up. And there is something up there. 
There are more of them. I see another one up here. That light them. Wait, right, there's another bell over here too. The light is a fire, maybe? Must be soaked through. Going to need something a lot hotter. Okay, well, I can't see any barrels around there, so. Listen, maybe a share? One, two, three, four, five, and all in range that siege weapon. Okay, let's see. Um, then we go. to be some documents about me. At last, I killed one of the deathless soldiers. I tracked him through the day until he was alone. He seemed to sense me before I struck, as if he knew the sound of my bowstring. He was strong, but I am clever and I have faith. My arrows pierced his flesh, but he fought on until I placed a shot between his eyes. Even then he managed to wound me before I caved in his skull. His body caught fire and fell into ash before my eyes. It has been hours since he died. But his ashes still smolder, hissing and popping in the darkness. I do not believe this is his end. The source has a great and terrible sway over those it touches. I must know what happens next. Okay, now to get up there. Hmm. Looks like I, like I can get up here too. But how? There is a bell inside there. It's definitely a bell. So there has to be another way. That maybe.
Hmm. Yeah, I can climb over there. But there's no way I can jump all the way across there. Wait. Yeah, that zip line goes down. Yeah, there's no way I can reach that zip line. Kind of easy to kill, at least. Incredible. The style looks ancient, but it depicts a train. The coming of the Soviets. Two more. And I know where one of them is. And that's the second one. Can I kill the birds? Well, that was no challenge. And how do I get up to that? Maybe a share. Wait. The statue is highlighted. Okay, so seven more statues I need to destroy. So, oh my, I've seen some of those. Okay.
have some coins up here. I think it's coins at least. Well, I was wrong. Some materials. In that area, let's see. Let's check that area. An ancient carving of a pagan god. Perhaps a fertility idol. It's thousands of years old. Is a challenge too? I don't know how to get up to that one. I don't think I can yet. Let's see uh, if I can dive here. Okay, there yeah, this one leads. Okay, that's a crypt then. After the city was built, 